Another Lost Phone isn't, strictly speaking, a sequel. It's a game that builds on the legacy of its predecessor, using some of the same tricks, but presenting them in a much slicker, more polished way. The story is still very much at the core, and it's pushed along by clever logic puzzles that see you delving for scraps of information on the phone that you've discovered. It deals with big issues, dark themes, and things that other games often shy away from. The game takes place on a phone that you found. By navigating through the various apps, you dig into the story of the person who's lost it. That can mean reading through text messages, figuring out passwords, and trying to connect the dots to find out what's happened to the device's previous owner. It would be easy for us to go into story details here, but we don't want to do that. This is a game you should come to without any preconceptions, finding out things in your own way and at your own pace. The mechanics are all intuitive and easy to understand. You're just poking your way through a phone, so it's going to come pretty much second nature to you at this point. There are some little problems, but nothing that detracts too much from the experience. And while the whole thing might sound a bit linear, there's a real exploratory nature to the game. You find out things in different orders depending on how you approach it, remembering notes you've read when the time is right, and stumbling across bits of information that drive the story forward. It deals with that strange thrill you get from looking through something you probably shouldn't be, and that sense of voyeurism gets darker the more you discover about what's going on. Suffice to say, Another Lost Phone is a super smart, super mobile puzzle game. It's about the engagement between technology and people and the stories our lives weave. It's precisely the thing we need to see more of on the App Store, so do yourself and everyone else a favour and go and give it a look.